Hey everybody, welcome back to Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, and we are going to be fixing this Chevrolet Corvette. Well, it's not really a Chevrolet Corvette, it's a knockoff, but you guys get the picture. Alrighty, first thing, let's take a look at the work order, and oh my dear god, we got a lot of work to put in this thing. A lot of running gear issues, so front sway bars, bushings, front shock absorbers, so first things first, we need to get the front wheels off, and we need to get the dr the uh, drive shaft out. So we'll go ahead and get the drive shaft out first, and actually we'll fix the gearbox problem because that's actually the most important to this automobile. Now ideally, we would more than likely take the exhaust off because, as you can tell, there's not that much room. Starter out, which is kind of grimy. Get our transmission out. Go. And I believe we're gonna check this, see if, if yeah, the starter was not on our list of things to replace, so it's not. So sparing the pressure plate. Off, come on, boom, boom. And the flywheel itself. Okay, so we take a closer look. Yep, pretty much the entire. Uh, so we need. Can we fix any of this? Let's see first off. Alright, so we need a gearbox V8 and then flywheel and all the clutch shit. So in here to our tablet and we have the main shop gearbox we need the gearbox for the v8 which is right there then boom 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 and boom this will take care of our uh, transmission issues and get this car back on the road Good part. Good part. Alright, and actually looking into here we could already see that side's got both sides is coming apart, but oh yeah yeah. This car needs a lot of love. Looking good. Alright, that's one thing part down. Next we're gonna go ahead and off the car. That rubber bushing is bad. I'm gonna check the okay, cross members are okay, which is a good thing. Golly, a lot of work in this car. Got that. Oh, I was gonna. 
this in. This side breaks look completely shot. Pretty much the entire front suspension of this car apart, and we're going to be replacing pretty much all of it. See, we found everything now. So, I mean, we got more rubber bushings, which tells me the bat. There's one's bad in the back. So we are going to uh, rebuild the front end first. See, and then come back here and see what remains. I suspect, like the rubber bushings for the rear end are shot. where I just go ahead and mark my rubber bushings that are bad because I don't see all of them. Oh, I am willing to bet you it is every single... Oh! Okay, I see. It is the ones that's in the control box. That makes a lot of sense now. here. First things first, we need to get a new steering rack. So we're going to start with the steering rack. Uh, suspension. I believe we need both inner and outer tie rods. So Inner outer tie rods. Okay, we need two of those. So, we'll start there. Steering rack, one in. In our tie rod, we need sway bar B. Sway bar B. So, we'll go back up here to front sway bar B. Now, we needed a lot of rubber bushings. I think we needed one, two, three, four, five. I think we needed like seven. So,. I will get five to start off with, and we'll go from there and we'll place them as we go. And if I have to buy more, I have to buy more. Uh, we'll get this rubber bushing installed. Get this inner tie rod. So say, I don't think, yeah, one front steering knuckle C needed to be replaced, so we'll put a good one back on over here. Put the outer tie rod on. The upper, I believe that one was okay, so that and that. And it looks pretty good, so I am going to. Oop, wrong one. Okay. Alright, 
both of those are bad, so you need two bottom suspension arms. And we need one upper. So let's first get the bottom. Bottom suspension arm, get two. And let's get the one upper. And I pass it like it. Oh, did I? There it is. I believe we needed at least one. We're gonna wait for wait for those first. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Yes. Looks good. So swivel our that new one in there. There we go. Good wheel hub in. get most of this put back together minus uh, the, the spring. There we go. It actually is going to allow me to put the tire on before that. That's now, I believe the entire unit needed replaced, so shock... Okay, yeah, that's what we're going to end up doing, is... Going in here, getting two double wishbone, get two, and leave two springs, and I believe we only needed one cap. So I'm going to go ahead and assemble the brand new one first. Actually, yeah, that's the, yeah, this is the one we want to separate. That other one can just be torn apart as is because it's kind of a jump. Alright, so go ahead and do that, do that, and that one. Yes. Alright. We're gonna get this car done pretty quick, guys. Do that. Boom, boom, boom. And that one can sit right there for the time being. So we'll go ahead and get this suspension piece in. Alright, if we look here, we should have... We're almost there. One rubber bushing, and then pretty much the other side of the car. So we just have to put the passenger side of the car back together, and we are in business. Uh, I believe I still need to buy like three more rubber bushings, so we'll go ahead and buy those right now. One, two, three. Boom those and oh I need front a new front steering knuckle that is right uh, front steering knuckle there is C uh, there it is get that boom new one bottom boom 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 new in good Upper in, boom, boom, boom. Looks good. Alright, now add over the tie rod. The shock absorber itself, the brand new one. Something tells me this car will be back at some point because that engine looks pretty rough. So it will more than likely need to get uh, rebuilt at some point, and I need a front wheel hub. Oh, uh, let's see. Front wheel hub. There we go. And brake on. What about the bearing? Oh, yeah, we need the wheel hub bearing on this side. Front wheel hub bearing. Brake pads. Brake caliper. Bada bing, bada boom, guys. We are almost there. That's it. Let's double check everything. Yep. Everything there. Everything there. Everything there. This car is done. $14,000 in our pocket. Cow a frickin' bunga. That is fantastic.
Looking good. Jordan Tour here. Do we have anything? Oh, yes, we could spend spend on something. Um, okay, we'll go ahead and unlock that one because we kind of have to start moving stuff up here. Okay. Uh, let's see. What do I want to do? Well, let's go ahead. Oh, you do see, this is a, a modded car, and it's actually nice to see that, so. Yo, dude, I need to get rid of my car, and I need to make it look good. Alright, let's go ahead and bring it in and see what the, oh my dear God, dude. Oh. This car is trashed. Wow. Okay. We're not going to start working on this car. That's going to sit there. What I am going to do is I'm going to show you. I've picked up a couple things, and you can see we got something very special there. So we're going to go take a quick look at it, and then I'm going to wrap up the video. All right. We are now in our parking garage once the screen loads. But cue the Jeopardy theme here. Come on. Come on, CMS. There we go. Alrighty. You guys can see we got two cool we got a nice Pontiac GTO here. We got another car, and then we have this really nice old Lincoln that we're gonna restore and make it real nice. But that's just a sneak peek of what we're going to be doing down the road. So, anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, all that good fun stuff. Until next time, have a good one.